everyone good morning this is daily v devotional guide for young minds today is march 7th 2024 i'm so glad to have you this morning i'm so glad you tried us let's pray before we continue our lord and our god we thank you for the privilege to be alive this morning father let your name be glorified in jesus name father we are sinners father we pray that you lord forgive us of all, our, of all our sins in the name of Jesus. Father, we pray that you don't grant your people the entrance of your word this morning and you grant the preacher your heart transfer. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Our topic this morning is rebusiness, the business of souls. Rebusiness, the business of souls. Our Bible text is Matthew chapter 16, verses 24 to 26. And her memory verse is Matthew chapter 16, verse 26. And I read, For what is a man profited, if he shall gain the whole world, and lose his own soul? Or what shall a man give in exchange for his soul? Message, What is a man profited? If he shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul, or what shall a man give in exchange for his soul? The, the greatest business you can ever see is the business of souls, of winning souls. Some people have lost everything they have in this business, while some people are enjoying everything they have gained via the same business. This business is a business that goes on and on, every day, every time, and everywhere. This business only involves three personalities, and they are God, man, and devil. God, man, and devil. Let's go on a short break. I am right excellent and successful. I'm for Christ, I will live for him. Welcome back. Thanks for your patience. Many have sold their souls to the devil and are still selling to the devil for money, for fame, for positions, sex, food, popularity, and so on. And they are regretting it today. The devil knows that once he lays hold on everyone's soul, on anyone's soul, he has laid hold on everything be it mentally, attitude, character, in summary, entire life. To whom you submitted yourself to as a slave of whom you are, says the scripture. To whom you submitted yourself to as a slave of whom you are, says the scripture. It's either you submit yourself to the Lord or you submit yourself to the devil. Choose wisely. That is why you must not trade your soul for anything with the devil. That is why you need to guide your heart with all diligence daily. As seen in Proverbs chapter 4, verse 23. Finally, I urge you to give God all that you have. Your spirit, your soul. And your body give god all that you have he made you and he knows the best for you tread on that path of of righteousness tread on his path of light trade yourself under god don't get traded under devils you don't need um to be traded um uh, uh, as a person under um devil's jurisdiction don't be a slave to the devil. I pray may the Lord help you to choose wisely, to be on his path till the eternity. Amen. Our scriptural truth. God never let his home down. Give him your lifetime and he will take care of you. My lifetime, I will give. God, my life.
lifetime. Give you give God your lifetime, and He will never let you down. He will never let you down. Prayer point, Lord, I give you my lifetime. Please don't let me down in Jesus' name. Pray with me again, God. I give you my lifetime. Please don't let me be let down in Jesus' name. Father in heaven, we thank you. Your word has been sown this morning. Father, we pray that you Lord make it fall on the good places. In the name of Jesus, Father, we pray that you Lord help us. Father, we pray that you won't let us down in Jesus' name. Father, we give you all our lifetime. Father, help us, Lord, in Jesus' name. Help us to win souls for you help us to be ever in you to ever be in your kingdom and never be in the devil's kingdom thank you because your name is always glorified and will always be glorified we appreciate you lord thank you the father we declare today blessed in the name of jesus father we pray today we are able to win souls for you let your name be glorified once again lord for in jesus mighty name we are prayed amen Good morning. See you next time. I am young and talented and successful.